um, this one boy is looking at me and I'm like, yes, I'm single. Let's go get on. show with you guys and I'm so excited about where I'm going that I will vlog uncomfortably in a public place in the airport as I shove my face with a bagel. <clears throat> Hopefully you just saw a really cute montage of me like getting ready and like all I did this morning like at rehearsal and stuff that I was supposed to finish on the way here but if you can see it's like night and I was also like Thankfully I was excused from rehearsal, so, um, this one boy is looking at me and I'm like, yes, I'm single. Um, I was excused from rehearsal early, for an hour, thank you Houston Ballet, <laughs> and my balls, um, but still, I was like panicked about getting here and then I didn't vlog. So the montage ends here, and I'm going to Fashion Week, and did I say that already? I'm going to Fashion Week, you can tell by the video, I'm so excited. Um, I'll talk more about it later, but I'm gonna finish this bagel. We're gonna get on the plane. I land at like midnight. It's like 7, my flight leaves at 7.45. Um, I'm like looking all over the place because I'm so paranoid. But I just need to embrace my youtuber -ness. Okay, this intro video part is too long. Bye. See you in New York for Fashion Week.
I am, right, well, I'm back at the airport because I need to go back to Houston and rehearse ballets. I just walked in my first fashion show for New York Fashion Week literally like four hours ago. It was crazy, it was madness, um, maybe a little drama, maybe I should do like a story time video, um, but regardless, it was just impossible to film and you know like it was a new collection that was being debuted and so like you're not allowed to take certain pictures and then I wanted to be respectful. I was also clearly not a model. Like I was like this little like lump of a chicken nugget walking around among these gorgeous black statuesque beauties. Um, so maybe I didn't want to film that part. <laughs> uh, but I did, I do have some like Instagram stuff and behind the scenes stuff um, that I've been seeing on the web already. It's crazy how fast they turn things out. So I will insert those clips as part of the video as well, but I'm heading back to Houston now. Um, this video is probably gonna be very short, but I had a lot of fun. Um, like, I can't believe I did that. So, Natalie got me a journal for Christmas and the new year starting and then it being my birthday, I was like, you know what? I really need to start journaling, writing things down. Everyone already does, has already been doing that for eons, but I think I'm like so proud of myself for like using it. Um, but I wanted to look back at the end of this year, 2020, and be like, what have I done? What have I wanted to do? What have I been able to accomplish? And one of the first things I wrote down was walk in a fashion show. And I did it, and it was New York Fashion Week. And I did it as a ballet dancer, and I did it for an amazing designer, Kenneth Nicholson from Houston, African American. Um, and I'm really, really proud that I did that. And I have exciting projects that are actually coming out tomorrow. I don't know when this uploads, but uh, follow me on Instagram shameless plug um but yeah it's been incredible and i can't wait to see what else i do this year and i can't wait um for you guys to keep watching <laughs> um okay i'm going to go check in for my flight i'm four hours early because i didn't want to walk around the city i just came here thought i could go, go get a shake shack but you're turns out you're not allowed to check into your flight like more than four hours before didn't know that okay well my flight's at 8. It's 4. I'm gonna go check in. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.